We're getting ready to celebrate Movember, also known as No Shave November. It's all part of an effort to get men to talk about prostate cancer. First News reporter Rod Cowan talked to a survivor today and learned the important message he's sending out to others. It's never too early for early detection. That is the message from Mercy Health about the upcoming Movember, which encourages men to grow beards to strike up conversations about prostate cancer. If you see somebody who normally would be clean shaven and they have a beard or a, or a mustache all of a sudden, start the conversation, ask them why. Paul Homick is the president of Mercy Health for the Mahoning Valley. He was one of the speakers at Monday's event. In 2019, 252 men across the valley had PSA screenings, 65 of them for the first time. The early screening is a simple blood test that takes about 15 seconds. 25 men required additional follow-up. Their PSA levels were elevated. They required additional follow-up with a doctor uh, to determine what was happening. Austintown Police Chief Bob Gavalier, along with Lieutenant Collins and Mayor Tito Brown, were on hand to raise awareness of early detection. Steve Burbrink was also there. He is a seven-year prostate cancer survivor. His cancer was detected back in 2012 while he was working on the new gen version of the Chevy Cruze for GM. I was fortunate. I had no clue that, um, you know, the, where this disease was going to go and anything about prostate cancer and how it can be resolved just by uh, an early blood test. After 38 years at GM, Steve now works part-time at Austintown Fitch High School and heads up a support group called Man Up in Cornersburg, which meets bi-monthly for men with stories of prostate cancer. In Austintown, Rod Cowan, WKBN 27, First News.